This is Sway. 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 In the morning. In the morning. In the morning. Shake your body. Wake your fuck ass up. Then cross out your eyes. Geechee Sway is here, ladies and gentlemen. Give him a round of applause. Sway. What up, man? Sway. What up? What you What's family? <laughs> <laughs> uh, How you been? Uh, Sonny Chiba is here, too. <laughs> Sonny, what, what up, up baby? Uh, what up, man? Uh, yeah, we got Gio. the legendary Ski Beats is here with us. Gear. What up, Sway? How you doing, baby? Hey, Kill man. Him. Come on, man. If you I complain, it. I say it all the time. Y'all wouldn't believe me. That's right. The one and only <laughs> Camp Blow is here. Ah. Uh. Man, thank you, thank you, thank first you, of all, you, man, you, good to you, see you guys. You, you. I feel like I missed them last time. That wasn't you did. Thing. You missed them last yeah. time. They were here. La with, yeah, last year. Yeah, yeah, yeah. With the 80 blocks. Yep. Yeah, the 80 that's right. With the 80 too. blocks. Yeah. With Pete Rock, yeah, right? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, um, you know, how you guys been? Camp Low is, you know, first came on the scene in the mid-90s. Um, and it was a uh, they they were a group that we we supported big time on the wake up show, which you can hear Monday nights here on um, on Shade Four yeah, Five. Yeah, uh, yeah. Uh, we always liked you guys, man. Thank you, thank you. The K M K M E L days. days. Yeah, 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 yeah. Really good right. days. <laughs> really good days. I remember that. I remember the Blazer I wore that day too. Damn. Yeah, you yeah, how yeah. You remember the Blazer you wore? Green. Elephant. It, it was green. It was green. It was like it was like olive. Uh huh. And so was the brim. The brim was on some olive posture. <laughs> Too. It was it was it was nice, man. Geech, you don't smoke, nice. huh? Uh, <laughs> 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 I don't know how the hell you remember that. Uh Lucini was a big song. This is it. Um uh that's what a lot of folks say. This mm -hmm. is it, y'all. And then you know, it was a, a chart buster and, and since then me and Ski was talking about this. You could make songs back then, Heather. That you could live on today. Hell yeah! My kind of mm -hmm. nigga. Yeah, like know. I was that, <laughs> my kind of nigga. That's what was on the radio. Like, yo, my kind of nigga. Yo. <laughs> you was barring, barring, barring. Thank you. Yeah, now, absolutely. Now, the Camp Low. Um, you, you you got the new the new project Ragtime High Times. Yes, sir. Yeah. And, and you 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 last time you. Well, up I'm with, sorry, Sway. It's actually yeah, Ragtime cool, High Times in a padded room of pink elephants playing with spiked mushrooms. Oh. That's what it yeah, actually. That's, that's the fact. Yeah, right but it's ragtime high times for short. Ragtime high times with a padded room. In a padded room. In a padded pink. room of pink elephants playing with mushrooms. Spike mushrooms. mushrooms. Spiked mushrooms. Yes, sir. Uh, so who's been ex experimenting with drugs in the crew? Like who? Who, who is that, Sonny? <laughs> I wasn't messing with no drugs though. Coming up with the title, you know uh -huh. what I'm saying? It was all sober. It was all sober. It was it's, all sober. Is there meaning behind that title? Yeah, like that padded room, being crazed out in the padded room. You got to get that, get that off your chest, like. Yeah. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? Release your energy. Release your energy. Yeah. Now, what Camp Low, man? What is what is um, Camp Low like? What do you guys talk about now? Like in 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 the, in the music, your subject matter. What is it that you guys? So is it just rhyming, or is it is it things that y'all bring to surface? I feel mm -hmm. like um. With this one, it's kind of like, um, you know, rag rag times for me is the rag times right up in here. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And uh, the hot by the way, has on a, uh, is that a two-piece suit or is that a three-piece suit? <laughs> <laughs> a a two-piece suit, you know, uh, suited and booted, ties and, and shoes. Like, he could be immediately no following though. here. No could, socks, No though. socks, but he, he could go to the Wall Street. Dominican, baby. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> All my Dominicanos out there. Yeah, so but <laughs> the rag times represent, you know what I'm saying? This is this is what I, this is what I, this is how I felt about it. You yeah. know what I'm saying? And the high times, you know, get you through the hard times, you know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. So, but um, going from Uptown to this, Ski being the third member of Camp Low, all that we've done from then till now, this project right here feels the closest to home, I'll say. Uh -huh. You know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. Closest to how we first emerged with it. Uh -huh. And uh, the Black Jesus was one of the last records we recorded that um that I see everybody is uh responding to that frequency because it's it's just when I walked in and I heard that beat, like I I I knew what it was. I knew what it was already. You know what I'm saying? That's what I do, Sway. That's what you do, right, Steve? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. They, 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 in case they walk in and they're not sure what they want to do, you let them know what it is. That's right. Okay. Did you when you made the beat, did you like did you had you you obviously made it for them, right? Did you? But well, when I made the beat, um I Ski really just create. Yeah, I just create. I didn't really have Ski anybody just, in mind, but Ski when I played creates. for him, I knew that you know it would work. It would work totally. Do, do we, Ski, you you got a chance to work with everybody. Mm -hmm. um, 
did, did, but for Camp Low as a producer, like, do you do you suggest, hey man, sound is changing now? You know, we you know we're at a different place. Let's let's do something like this. Or I mean, do you give them direction? I mean, how do y'all work in the studio? Y'all just it's it's all vibe. It's all energy. It's just like you know, I make a track. Um, and if it feels like low, then it just feels like low. If it don't, then we just don't do it. But, and it's, it's always, we always bounce an energy yeah, off yeah, each other. You know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, yeah. Well, I make I, a beat. I might come up with a hook. Sway might come up with a hook. Uh -huh. uh, Chiba might come up with a flow or whatever. Oh, then we just start hook working game is there. crazy. Yeah. Ski's hook game been crazy since Ching. Uh -huh. Ski hook, you know, yo, I, I, these brothers, they both Virgos. I'm, I'm I'm the cancer, you know what I'm saying? They they, they bring in a whole nother dynamic to the table with it. But, uh... His yeah, why you game, put the Virgo out there like that? Oh, sorry. Yeah, His hook game always complimented. The, the 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 he just brings a uniform uh -huh. to it. You know what I'm saying? He brings a uniform yeah, to it. I remember um, though. Yeah, yeah. 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 You That's, know when you work with someone so long, you just kind of know. You got a picture in your head of what they, you know, what the whole scope or the whole theme of the album is gonna be about. Yeah. So every time I make music with them, it's, it's like I already see what it's gonna look like uh -huh. damn near. So, you know, it's easy to make hooks for them. It's easy to create music for them. It's like there's like a we a, get together and we 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 pick up where we left off right. uh -huh. and then go somewhere else uh -huh. at the same time. You know what I'm saying? All right. Well let's we're, 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 we're in uh constant departure while arriving at the same time. I like that Geechee, cause he getting he philosophical this morning. <laughs> <laughs> He's killing me. That's because he ain't got no socks on. Is that what it is? Yeah. Well, look, let's give um, the audience. I'm gonna open up the phone lines. Camp Low is here. 888 That's crazy. Seven four two three. Seven four two three three four five. Um, is his ankles at? Are they ashy? Nah, yeah, I'm, I'm on them. On I'm on them. Your ankles are right. Use okay, that coconut thank you. oil. Thank you. Okay. All right. They got the new album. It's called Ragtime Hot Times. The full length uh, full title length is title. in a padded room full of pink elephants playing with spike mushrooms. There it is, man. I like that. We got uh, Mark on the line from Denver. Mark, what up? Thank uh, you. That Black Jesus track, man, I roll to that every day. That's, Thank that's you, on bro. fire. Thank Appreciate you, that, man. Wow, Appreciate man. that, man. That's what's up, Mark. Appreciate that. Appreciate that. Mark's yeah. a uh, straight up hip hop head, too. Yeah. You know, Ski and I were having this conversation outside because Ski had been on the road with uh, Mob Deep. And when mm. I when I went to France um, over the summer, uh, I was seeing Mob Deep had like sold out shows out there, and you know and the the the, wow. the the appreciation for um, you know the affinity for that '90s hip hop overseas is amazing. It's, it's incredible, right? Yeah, totally. Yeah. Uh, what about Camp Law? Have y'all been able to do a lot overseas yet? Yeah. Our last little walk was in Japan. Uh huh. Yeah, yeah. We we we've touched a lot of um. Very interesting places. Pac was like the first one that said things that you put in a the song, they, they they manifest. So yeah, that's a fact. I started stuffing wild places um, in Uptown Saturday Night, like Ski in Switzerland, down in Morocco, gambling, handling, beat out for my, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So like all of these places that we was, that I was throwing in rhyme, then we would later travel to these places. In France, I danced by the moon, you know what I mean? Like, so all of these places we have now touched you know through through song and 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 it's you get out there and it's like it's like brand new man it's like it's it's amazing the, it's really dope you know what uh i don't know if it puzzles me uh if that's the right word but it, you go overseas and you find folks have this deep appreciation for the culture mm -hmm. absolutely in, in mm -hmm. a different way like ski was telling me that mob deep was had like where's khalifa opening up for them you know, because they they respect the the, the mm -hmm. pioneers, the ones that laid the the brick down totally. first. What mm -hmm. is your reception like in the states for Camp Low? Is it the same way as it is overseas? Yeah, we just came from Philly. Uh, uh, Saturday we was in Philly, and um, yeah, it was it was dope. Before that, we was in Toronto, and well, Toronto I guess is over there, but it's still kind of close to NY. But yeah, no, I think people just kind of miss what they what they've. What they miss, you know, mm -hmm. we we kind of had a, a really a really good impact when we first did our thing and stuff like that, and I, I think people just kind of miss that. They miss the Lauren Hills, the D'Angelos, the Maxwells, the you know, like they they miss it, you know. They so so, I I think uh it, it's it's great. They the response is just like, damn, where y'all been? Uh, you know, blah, blah, blah. it's just you it's know, great. Man. You know it's what great. though? Sometimes I feel like over here in the states, man. We got this stigma about, you know, oh, he's an old artist. They old. They old school. Yeah, that old they school shit, that. like, come you know on. I mean? uh, like, that's, yeah. that's. 
and that's... and and when you like overseas or you know somewhere else across the world they look at you more like oh you're legendary uh, and, and 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 we are so happy that you're here and we love you because we you know we got like mob deep now they've been in the game for over 20 years yeah mm-hmm. they got like fans that's like 17 18 that's in the that's at their shows front row is always all younger kids yeah and it's like they wasn't born when that you know when that music mm-hmm. came out uh-huh. but the energy that that music was um the rebellious young energy that that music was portraying yeah resonates forever yeah, you see what i'm saying forever. so you can't even you know that it's incredible and it's just it's forever if people in the states if kids in the states would just kind of like pay homage and just really pay attention to you know music and how it came from they would have a way bigger appreciation for you know mm. the guys who paved the way you know mm-hmm. what i mean absolutely I but agree. you know everybody wants to be like oh what's new what's the newest hip thing that's the thing with america we always want to be what's the what's, what's the next, next? what's, what's next? next you see yeah, what i'm yeah, saying yeah, yeah. go back learn your history and you can see you'll know what's next if you go yeah. back if yeah. It, yeah and and on, and to add on top of that ski honestly i just feel like we were actually more futuristic than than we are oh. now. You know Cam what I'm Lowe, saying? man, yo, Cam Lowe is timeless. Right. I mean, the, the the things they say, nobody in the world's ever gonna say what they say. Yeah, we so don't they can, deal with time there's like no, that. Exactly. Yeah. There's what no time box for them. You don't deal with time like that, okay. Nah. Wanted some <laughs> metaphysics right there. Yeah, yeah. that's right. Yeah. Yeah. That, son. <laughs> it's, it's no design, no uniform. Right. You know uh-huh. what I'm saying? Because it's like, when he, another thing that he means is that when people make music, a lot of times they make music for what's going on right then and there. Right, when we right. just kind of always yeah. just did what we love to do, uh-huh. what just came natural. So it didn't come with a it didn't come with the time attached to it. It, it was just it didn't come with instructions. Yeah, that's what that's what music is about. True artistry is about being artistic, man. It ain't about okay, well, you know, if Drake is rapping like this, then I need to rap yeah. like Drake because like that's that what the bread is Oh, at. this is what's winning, so hard. let's do that. Nah. Yeah. That's corny. Yeah. We, you know yeah. what I mean? Yeah. Never, I never was like that. Never yeah. was like that. Yeah. And that's like disposable, that. too. All day. Totally. That's like disco. Absolutely. Yeah, and you know, <laughs> here. when y'all mentioned being legendary, which is such a special word, and, you yeah. know, years go into that, success goes into that, and I think for both of those elements, we need hurdles to be conquered. Right. So I'm always curious when, um, especially now three people, when you guys have been able to just stay connected for so long, what are some of the adversaries that you guys had to just get over and how did you conquer them? Well, for me, you know, just getting older and feeling like, you know, you're not relevant anymore in the game and, you yeah. know, there's a whole new thing. I had to get over that. You yeah. know what I mean? Yeah. I said to myself, you know, fuck it. I love music and I'm going to always make music. I don't give a fuck if you like it or not. I like it. Right. Boom. So right. once I got over that, I was good. That was my hurdle for me personally. Yeah. Hmm. What was you guys? Anybody y'all had a hurdle? Um, That's a... Yeah, I I'm mean, like, that's an honest hurdle. It is an honest yeah. hurdle. It is an honest hurdle. Yeah. So, like, I always been real sensitive about the old school shit because, like, I know the old school. Like, they raised me. You know what I'm saying? I never felt like I felt like I was in between the old school and and whatever's happening right now. Like, I'm in the middle of that. Yeah. You got you got what's going on now. You got what happened, and then you got where we came in at it. You know what I mean? It's like, okay, how am I? How is? But I. Somebody explained this to me. Said, "No, not old, like like as in you're old, but as a, there's a certain feeling that was attached to what you did. Yeah. I had to understand where they were coming from mm-hmm. with it, which ties back into the to the legendary thing. You know yeah. what I'm saying? That yeah. damn hurdle for me, B, is always comparing our music to our first album. Yeah. Mm. Oh man. Yeah, it's the worst. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's yeah. the hurdle. That's the hurdle, right? Yeah. You know, I think Jay would get that a lot early yeah. on. You know, people wanted that reasonable doubt." He said, "Buy, you know, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. With that line if you want, if you want reason with that, go buy that. Go, go buy, buy my old shit. Buy yeah. my old mm, album. Yeah. You know, um, man, Camp Low is here. Eight 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 seven four two three three four five. We got, uh, is it Amari? Amar? Amar from Chicago. What, what up, up, Amar? Bro? Big Amar. What up? Hey, good morning, everybody. Good morning. What you want to say, to Camp Low? Shout out to you. Hey, just just want to say that there's certain albums I got in rotation in my car, and it's. It, it's to me, it's the classics that I got: Jay Z, Biggie, Big Pun, Nas, and I always got Camp Blow Uptown. And, and every time I play it, people say, "What is that?" And nobody knows. But I gotta, I, I gotta teach them. When I play it, everybody wants to go get that album and go download it off iTunes. So I just want to so. say, you know, that, yeah. still today. I got that in my rotation. Because real music Thank you, brother. is timeless, baby. It's time. Yeah. Hey, hey, um, uh, hey, why don't you get the new album, too, okay? It's right out time, now. high times, available. I will. 
sure. Get it for today. Sure. I want everybody tuned in to get that today. We're going to go to today. um uh, uh, uh Texas. We got uh is it George? Yeah. Yo, George. what up, George? Hey, big George. Hey, hey. what's going on? Jorge. Hey. <laughs> hey, so you guys are known for your lingo and making up a lot of your words. I was just wondering if you've heard any of your words, like, in in weird places, like words that you made up. Somebody um recently was saying something about lit, and they, uh, like, lit is a new, like, term, I guess, or whatever that's really popular, and they was asking us if we felt as though it circled back to Lucini. You know when we when we were saying lit, and I was saying that all things in that realm is is possible. You know what I'm saying? But um, yeah, that that lit lit would be one right now. That's just so. What does just, lit, what does lit mean in your definition? Um, let's get lit was definitely like yeah, yeah, you know, <laughs> oh, you know, yeah, yeah. I don't know if y'all invented that, good. man. Let's I think my, my father, my oh, yeah. no, that's a go back. Yeah, that's yeah, a go back. How y'all gonna claim lit? All right, <laughs> <laughs> no masturbating in public. All right, there it is. We got is it smoke from Pennsylvania? <laughs> smoke superstar, sway. What up, family? How you doing? What's up, baby? How you doing? Hey, I just wanted to say, man, I've been rocking with Camp Low, man, from the beginning, man. I just got to say this. Y'all was the first ones really on that fly shit, talking that shit. Like, I mean, a lot of, everyone knows New York artists for being lyrical, but y'all also mixed in the lyrical with the fly lingo. I just got to say that, man. I've been a fan since Uptown Saturday Night, man. I rock with y'all Appreciate 100. That. Thank, Thank you, brother. You, bro. Thank it's you, true, man. man. And we Thank just you. found Thank out, you. like, I, they talked it so good. That I felt like y'all did and had all those things you were saying until you just told me, Geech, that <laughs> you learned to just put it in the universe yeah, and then mm-hmm. it came to and fruition. And then it came to fruition. Yeah. Wow, man. Yeah, because when we when um when I first got with Ski, I was like 15, 16 years old, man. Uh-huh. Like this this man, you know what I'm saying, showed me showed me it all. I was my, my mentor, my big bro, all of that, you know what I'm saying? Just seeing him go ham on the drums and stuff like that. Like little Little back flipping on dirty mattresses, <laughs> skateboarding kid, you know, through the hood. The ski came through and just opened up a whole new, whole new world to me. But yeah, so like I just been a student, ever, you know, I just been a student, man. And um, yeah, I saw, I saw all of them. The first time, the first thing Jay Z ever said to me was, uh, "What's up, shorty? You want to battle?" When when uh, Ski took me through Clark <laughs> Clark Care House for the first Yo, that's time. That's the first thing Jay <laughs> that's said. That's the first thing he said to me in my life. And yeah. Clark hit the button on the SP, and the beat came on, and Jay just erupted it, and it was just dope. And I just been, I've been absorbing that ever since, man. You know what I'm saying? Wait, hold but, up, Geech. But yeah. So what did you do after Jay spit his verse? Uh, 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 you know, <laughs> I, I, I was, I just, I was mesmerized, man. I was like, yo, yeah. you know what I mean? Yeah. You spit one back? I, I, didn't, I, didn't, I didn't spit one back, man. Damn, you lost the battle to Jay. <laughs> <laughs> you got that L on your record, baby. <laughs> Seen the, seen the same thing happen to Pocky, you know? oh, One up against the greatest. Oh, Catch an L. Uh, wow, but what an amazing experience to yeah, have. Yeah, it was, it was, yeah. it was. It just lets you, it just, you, you see how somebody was just already on, you know what I mean? Was just already there in so many different ways, man. It just makes you want to, just makes you want to rise to the occasion, man, you know? And, um, but yeah, you put things into song, you put things into the universe, and, and they, they manifest, man, if you continue to really, really believe in it. You know what I'm saying? It's Sway in the Morning. Only on Shea 45.